Uh, mine, I didn't, I picked a moment that uh, I didn't like. So let's roll that moment. I am totally in favor of vaccines, but I want smaller doses over a longer period of time. Just the other day, two years old, two and a half years old, a child, a beautiful child, went to have the vaccine and came back and a week later got a tremendous fever, got very, very sick, now is autistic. We have extremely well-documented proof that there's no autism associated with vaccinations. But it is true that we are probably giving way too many in too short a period of time. One of the greatest, one of the greatest medical discoveries of all time were, were the vaccines. But I'm also for freedom. I'm also a little concerned about how they're bunched up. Okay, this is a really bad thing to happen to the Republican Party. An anti, a, a hysterical anti-science point of view about, about vaccines. And using an anecdote with a child is destructive and it's ignorant because it's not science. There, there's a, this, uh, uh, it's a false causal argument to say because vaccines and, and autism symptoms appear at the same time, ergo the uh, vaccines cause autism. That's the same as saying, you know, when you have, you have ice cream and you get sunburn in the summertime, therefore ice cream causes sunburn. It's stupid and it's bad for Republicans. And not only that, it's de deadly and it's dangerous. We're seeing outbreaks of measles all around the world. We're seeing it in Australia. We're seeing it in Africa where people are actually dying. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, we're having outbreaks in Disneyland. Why is this happening? Because people are listening to bozos who are questioning the validity of what is really a wall. Science built a wall against disease, and it's called vaccines. If you're going to be for a wall for immigration, you should be a wall for a wall against uh, for did, disease. Did the other two agree with them, though? It was sense. terrible. They're doctors, and it, I, I'm glad Ben Carson feebly came up and said something. But they are doctors, and, they're, and, they, and they have a responsibility to defend the profession because there are doctors like them every day who have to con confront this argument. Whenever they go in there and they have worried mothers or elderly people who don't want vaccines, they're the ones in the front line. And those doctors are on TV, and they should have come out. They should have been forthright about it. Ben slightly did it, but he's so soft-spoken. He was barely there. And Rand, who cares about Rand? Oh, no, but I think, you know, hats off, that's just so strong and so right. I'm so glad you said that. And I like what Carson said when he said, yeah. so maybe he's an okay doctor. Yeah. <laughs> Republicans aren't the only one with that problem, though. Yeah, no, Hillary had Hillary the same issue, issue in the, uh, in the uh, primary, uh, primary 2008. Mm -hmm. She said that she was going to look into the causes of autism, including vaccines. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't Christie also flip-flop on, on, on that? Well, maybe they, 